Healthy Vegan! I make a fruit salad today, very simple. I have some nuts and berries, yeah? And I have peaches, no, nectarines, mangoes, apple, orange juice, I show you. I make the dressing first. Yeah, very simple, I have um, nectarines and cashews here. See? Two or three nectarines. And a handful of cashews, half cup or so. And I have uh, juiced some oranges. One and a half cup of orange juice, I guess it is. I guess that's the right amount. I begin... I just put it in. Better dance. From what I can see from outside, I would say it's a nice texture, not too thick. That was a concern a little bit, taking too much um, cashews or too much uh, nectarines, too little juice, make it too thick perhaps. You know what, that's nice and creamy. Let's taste it. Mm. How wonderful. The creaminess of the cashews, like a cream, and the sweet and sour from the nectarines and the oranges. I let sit for a while and combine the main ingredients of my fruit salad. And I had that here, the main ingredients are one mango, you see super ripe, super delicious. Mango is really outstanding ripe and I have some nectarines here too. I, they go to nice, so very, very nicely together. They are more sweet, this is more sour sweet. Both fruit are high in fiber. And that's the specialty of um, plant food, yeah. plants, vegetables, fruit, have fiber. That's what we cannot digest, broadly talking. A little bit we can, but for the broad thing is that we cannot digest the fiber, and that's why they are so important. They balance the intake of nutrients. So you have sugar in fruit. It is good because you have the fiber, and the fiber keeps the sugar from spiking into the blood. Yeah, the fiber moderates it. So with fiber, with whole fruit, you cannot eat too much fruit. But some doctors still believe, oh, don't eat fruit too much sugar. That's complete nonsense. It has been proven by science. Big studies. If you want to know the studies, you can ask me. I'll show you the studies. They're out there. Big studies for a long time already. No problem. So here I have an apple. It's a crunchy. And a blueberries. And the doctor said you should eat two cups blueberries every day. Two cups frozen blueberries. These are fresh. Yeah, maybe one cup is enough, but it gets better. Your, your mind gets better. Actually, it's proven. And there's so many, um, um, so many wonderful um, effects of blueberries. Yeah, uh, I don't enumerate now the effects of all these fruits, plants here. They are endless. Yeah, but they're all healthy. You know, fruit is healthy. Remember, and these are red currants. They have this wonderful sour flavor, sour sweet, a little more sour. And another cup of cashews here, yeah. That's that's uh, together here. It's a wonderful combination. It's a nice breakfast. It's a big salad, yeah. Whereas, when I always when I eat fruit, just fruit for breakfast, I eat a lot because um, I can fill uh, my tummy up with fruit and still feel happy without feeling too heavy, too thick, uh, tired. No, fruit is light. Yeah? And that makes it wonderful. So I have a look at the at the dressing again. I taste it again. Maybe I have to blend one more time. The texture is wonderful. Mm. Wow, it's so good. Gonna try that. One more time. Just for the creaminess. Here, have the cashews blended and it's stand for a moment, sit for a while, two minutes or so, and then blend a second time. It gets wonderful creamy. I show you now, it looks so nice now. 
And this is a really nice texture. You see? Ah, it's almost a smoothie, but I would take it for a, for a dressing because with a smoothie, for a smoothie I would have added maybe another ingredients to make it taste different. But here for a dressing, it has its own flavor added to the fruit flavor here. So it is a different, when you make a dressing, it's not actually the same and then making a smoothie. Smoothie has to taste nice by itself. A dressing has to taste nice together with the fruit or the salad you put it on. So I will just toss it carefully and then enjoy. And in case I won't eat it right now because it's a lot, I could put it in the refrigerator and let it sit for a while and eat later. It doesn't matter. It doesn't get bad, yeah? You don't, shouldn't uh, keep it too long. But this is a wonderful portion for a whole uh, thick meal, maybe, maybe two meals, <laughs> but I love it. It's super healthy, super delicious, and easy to make, summertime. You can't get wrong. Put the fruit together you like, add some nuts, some seeds, make a nice dressing, that's it. It's so easy. Let's all be vegan. See you soon. Uh, soon. <laughs> uh, maybe you want to subscribe every week on YouTube, have another recipe every single day. I show you a recipe to encourage people to try something new always. Uh, Plant-based food is such a variety. It's a whole new world now. And there's even this, something like the vegan flavor. That flavor that is by itself healthy. Uh, if you don't have the process, too much processed, uh, or you know, the white flour or sugar, pure sugar, refined sugar, not in, not in, in, in fruit sugar. Fruit in fruit, that is perfect. But when you separate these ingredients, you don't have the whole food anymore. Then it becomes a problem. Whole food is almost always healthy if it's from plants. So that's very easy. I will inspire you to use more and different kinds of fruits. It's also easy. You have to find out what you like. Yeah? And you can't go wrong. Again, thanks for watching. And you can also find me on Facebook, Instagram, Pinterest and Twitter. I hope to see you soon.